Good morning guys! So this morning we are off to The Grove um, which is more near like Melrose, Beverly Hills side. So we're now getting the Uber there and we shall be there in about 15 minutes. I get to have a feel of it before yeah. any of the other models get to so I'm feeling like VIP right now <laughs> just joking but yeah this is um, where it's all gonna be happening pretty cool hey but I'm here with Jesse and basically what they're doing today are workshops where you can paint your own nails and whatever color you paint you can take the nail bars with you or you can go to the nail bar and get your nails done Technicians, but look at the cute. Thankfully, I came with my nails unpainted, so perfect. And I like this color, so I think I'm just taking this home today. starting your own thing or when it's your own you work 24 7 365 your brain is never off so when I worked at L I had this really amazing thing like it was back in the golden the golden years when I had a cell phone but not a smartphone and I had a computer at work but not at home and so when I left the office on a Friday that was pretty much it until Monday like I didn't think about work it was my own time um, and when I started working for myself and realizing I'm never all I'm never really off I had that was a struggle for me in the beginning because I loved having that like designated I don't have to worry about anything time and it changed who I am but um, when you really love something you work harder than you had any idea it was possible So in case you're wondering why I'm wearing these eye peels or I'm eye masks and why he's wearing this eye mask, <laughs> he's wearing it because he's a copycat. <laughs> <laughs> no, um, we were sent the zero skin eye masks by... I'm more like a guinea pig. <laughs> <laughs> we were sent these eye masks before we actually came to LA and um, we just thought we would try them out today. Yesterday I wanted to try them out but I couldn't because I have very sensitive skin and because we had the Rebecca Minkoff show I was a little bit too scared in case I had a reaction and it you know I wouldn't have had time to try and fix it before the show although I'm saying that I have sensitive skin these are feeling really really nice they're very soothing don't you find them quite soothing one thing I would suggest is if you're gonna wear these I don't know if you can see as I'm talking to you they probably are falling a little bit so um I think it's better if you put these on and then like just lay down and just rest and as you only have to wear them for like 15 to 20 minutes max I think you can like chill for that long I don't think it's a problem 
So these eye masks are made from apple and green tea. I have the, bo um, the box here with me just in case I forget. But um, yeah, so this is the packaging. I think I show you at the beginning of the video. So they come in this really small, sleek box. I think it's a really nice packaging. And also it's perfect if you're on the go and you're traveling anywhere. Um, for me, I took this when I was on the plane and it's easy for, you know, if, you, if you've got a cabin bag or a handbag and you just want to put these on before or during the flight, this is perfect, perfect size. You get eight of these in here. Um, yeah, and to be fair, the, the instructions on the box are very simple, very easy to follow. So what they're supposed to do is if you have dark circles underneath your eye, they are supposed to lighten up your eyes. I don't really have dark circles. I'm quite lucky and do you have dark circles? I get them because I work around the clock while she's sleeping. If I could show you this morning of how many times I had to wake him up. Anyway, so, so um, yeah, like um, in terms of, what was I saying? Um, what it does. Yeah, so in terms of what this actually does, it's supposed to correct dark circles. And like I said, like I, said I don't really have dark circles, but recently um, we've been going to events, we've been sleeping very, very late, early mornings, and this has just been probably a perfect thing to try out because I did start to notice um, you know a slight discolor under my eyes so I guess a tiny you know dark circle so I'm gonna see how this works sorry I keep moving it it's just because literally it's not actually it, it moving keeps, that much. like I can see in the lens that it's falling down a little it. bit and, you know it's got like a gel form on there so until it dries and sets of course anything that's slippery is going to slip Downwards. I think if you, if, if you stay still or kind of like lay down for the first five minutes yeah because they, they, they do start to dry and do you know what actually is really great in the packaging have like this little small sachet and um, the little tiny peel that come out of that comes out of this um, obviously has the gel on but once you have finished after 15 20 minutes you can take it off and there will be remaining gel inside here that you can use for the rest of the face and the great thing is you don't need to cleanse your face after you you will not be left with a sticky or wet um is it residue 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 i think residue or residue i don't know how to pronounce mm -hmm. it but you will not be left with anything on your face um it does um, it's supposed to, you know, just leave your face ready, ready if you just want to put cream on, you want to put your makeup on after, toners, whatever it is you want to do, it's fine. Um, you don't have to be worried about cleaning it after. So that for me is key. Yeah, so check them out. I'm going to put their link at the bottom of the video. So they're called Zero Skin. I believe they are a UK brand, mm -hmm. right? Yeah, so they're a UK brand. Um, check them out on Instagram they have like their link to their website for other products you might be interested in and I'm really looking forward to finding out what else they uh, what other products they have and trying out new products of theirs so we're just gonna chill now check our emails and it's getting like I don't know if it's bright looking here to you but um, it is actually getting to the evening now so we're gonna head to Pasadena like shortly um, and yeah, that's going to be our evening. We'll just see what tonight holds.